Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I am here to do a reading for Scorpio. This is for Scorpio, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus, and this is for November, okay? So we're just going to see what comes up. Two cards just fell out, so we got Kite, Vacation. So you need a vacation, or you're planning a vacation, or vacation is going to be happening this month. Ooh, V, victory in some endeavor. And it's interesting because vacation begins with V as well. So you're going to have victory in some sort of endeavor. Maybe you need to treat yourself to a vacation. So anyway, what do we have for Scorpio, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus? What do we have for Scorpio? Younger man. We have a younger man that is going to be prominent for you this month. Going to affect your life in some way. Libra. Could be a Libra. Could also be justice. It could be a time where there's justice. You know, where there's some sort of legal uh, situation that is unfolding. There's some sort of decision that is going to be made. It's going to be a fair and just decision. There's a younger man that is involved. What do we have for Scorpio? Ace of Swords. It says Ace of Michael. A wonderful new idea. Don't allow bumps in the road to hinder your progress. Clear up communication problems with others. So there's going to be some clarity. Something is going to be cleared up. Some information is going to come out that clears up. Truthful information is going to come out. Okay? So there is some sort of truthful information that is going to be coming out this month. Um, that clears up any type of uh, communication problems or uncertainty. Clarity is coming, and I feel like there's some sort of truth that's coming out, okay? There's a younger man that is involved, and the Libra is about truth as well. So if something has been hidden, and whether you are the cross watcher or not, there is, say, say you're the cross watcher and your Scorpio has been lying, or if you're the Scorpio and your, your person has been lying, some sort of truth is coming out, okay? What do we have? What do we have? King of Cups reversed. You may be really in your emotions, okay? You may be feeling really emotional at this time. There could be even some emotional withdrawal or not really communicating. You may be going within, you know, uh, withholding your feelings, not expressing your feelings. Then we have this chariot, which is uh, finding the determination and the mental strength to take charge so somebody is doing that they're getting in the driver's seat they're taking charge of a situation could be dealing with the cancer we have pisces cancer scorpio here we also have libra um things are going to be going in a new direction the challenge is uh, replacing fear with faith taking the lead taking charge somebody is going to be taking charge okay they're going to be uh traveling in a new direction this may be your vacation okay um Ten of Pentacles reversed. Devil in the past. Uh, Knight of Swords in your uh, present. Knight of Swords reversed. We have an untrustworthy individual here. Somebody that you cannot trust. There is an untrustworthy individual here that doesn't tell the truth. That lies a lot. This is dangerous. May even have some mental health issues. Um, blaming somebody. Picking a fight. Somebody may be picking a fight. This could be explosive energy. This is somebody that is on oh, my nose is itching is on a, miss, on a mission. This person um, is putting some plans in action. They may not be good plans. This may be, be somebody that is in the military, that has been in the military, that is, uh, this is somebody that is leading others into danger or something like that. Presently, picking a fight. 
moon reversed in your future um, reality check truths being revealed which we already uh, established three of swords reversed page of wands death ace of swords reversed in your outcome somebody definitely hasn't been telling the truth uh, eight of swords uh, next to that that is confinement restricting restricting not telling the truth being dishonest uh, dishonest communication, restricting. Um, I don't know if there's prison even. There's some, there's somebody is in some sort of mental prison or there's lies. Somebody could even end up going to prison or going to jail. I just got to say that whenever I see the Eight of Swords, I always think about prison. Anyhow, um, currently you are dealing, I feel like you're dealing with a water sign. I feel like you're dealing with a Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. I'm not sure if this person is a lawbreaker or you're the lawbreaker. There's somebody here that has been breaking the law. Um, this person does not care who they hurt. This is an untrustworthy individual. They are obsessed. They have addictions. Um, they probably have been hiding their addictions. They've been doing it very, very well. Uh, the devil is mirroring the moon. Uh, the moon is reversed. Okay. I feel like we have something to do with a vehicle here. Somebody's, uh, I don't know if they're on drugs or something. They get behind the wheel and some, you know, things get out of control. It could be a dangerous situation. I do see out of control with that uh, Knight of Swords. We may even have somebody here that it cannot, uh, doesn't have good intentions that is doing something that is out of control. Um, there's an unstable business or family life here in the Ten of Pentacles reversed underneath you. This is like unstable, insecure business or home life. There could be some short-lived success. There may even be financial disaster, huge loss, losing it all, uh, false impressions, the collapse of an empire, the end of a legacy. We may have somebody here that, you know, is fighting over money or they just, this is a very unstable business or home situation. That's the basis of this reading. We have a financial burden, financial loss, or lies and deception that is being revealed. Um, we have somebody here that is obsessed. They are very, very, very obsessed. They are materialistic. They're infatuated. They are tied to something. It could even be just a codependent behavior. It could be drugs. It could be alcohol. It could be another person. The devil is in the past. We have this is toxic behavior. It's an obsession. This is somebody who... Uh, needs gratification at all times so we have somebody here that likes to be in the limelight they do not care who they hurt because the knight of swords is reversed this is an untrustworthy individual maybe somebody that you live with or that you worked with or something like that um knight of swords reverse clueless know-it-all looking for a fight out of control moving very very fast driving fast somebody's doing something they're doing something they're doing something in a hurry they're going someplace in a hurry this person doesn't like to be held accountable for their actions. They hide, they hide, they hide behind a mask. Um, but there's some sort of reality check that is coming. There are truth that is coming out. It may be even embarrassing. It could be even a public embarrassment. Um, there's something that is coming out that is going to be revealed. There's, it's, it's a real, 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 real truth. Um, I feel like uh, your advice is the three of swords reverse. So your advice is to let it go. And I know that's easier said than done. And I feel like it's time for you to focus on your future. Um, maybe you have a conversation with this person, let them know how they hurt you or whatever, and then just walk away. It's time for you to focus on your future. This is release the pain. Okay. Leave the past behind. It's time to leave this behind. There's somebody that you or something that you need to leave behind. Okay. Um, your per your outside influence is the page of wands. The page of wands is an exciting new adventure, exciting new opportunity. This is, could even be a new suitor that is bursting into your world or a new offer or an invite that is more aligned with who you are, who, who you are. Okay. Um, you do have another, you're going to be receiving an offer or an invite or a new pathway is about to open up that is more better suited for you. Okay. But you're going to need to focus and take a risk and just go for it. Okay. Just go for it. somebody. Maybe it's a fire sign, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, that is going to be giving you this opportunity. This person may be a little bit younger than you, but there is somebody here that is going to be giving you an opportunity and maybe it's just time. Maybe it's time for you to go on a new adventure. Maybe do something exciting. Maybe even travel. Maybe that's your vacation. Um, 
it's time for a new approach, right? That's the page of wands, okay? It's time for a new approach. Now, in your hopes and fears, we have the death card, which is an ending that leads to a new beginning. I feel like you're having a hard time letting go of something. There is going to be an ending. This is the end of something. It's the end of something that has affected your life in a very big way with a new beginning to follow. So there's this a separation or a loss with a new beginning to follow. Um, it's a time of transformation. It's a time of change. But I feel like I feel the overall outcome is the Eight of Swords and the Ace of Swords reverse. This is not wanting to accept, staying stuck. You know, it's like uh, refusing, refusing to move on from your safety zone in denial, in denial of the truth. I feel like you really need to think about you need to think about uh who you're dealing with somebody could even end up in prison pay attention to who you're dealing with i feel like you have somebody here that is dangerous okay they they have ulterior motives this person um has addictions they have obsessions they're extremely materialistic they may be even breaking the law you may be somehow involved with this person you may need to get yourself out of this situation before you get yourself in trouble, before you get yourself in jail, before you get yourself, you know, restricted. There's some sort of restrictions here that are probably going to be imposed in the future because the overall outcome is the Eight of Swords and the Ace of Swords reversed. There's some sort of truth that is being revealed. Somebody has lied. Eight of Swords is lies. It is lies. But it's refusing to see the lies, refusing to accept the lies, refusing to acknowledge the lies. So somebody is totally refusing to acknowledge the truth. Therefore, they're trapped in their own prison, or they could even end up in prison, or maybe it's mental prison. I don't know. Um, I feel like it's, it's, this is a time of change. It's a time of profound change. Okay, that's what the death card is, but you have to accept it. You have to allow it. You can't, don't fight it. But you're, I think that you're going to be dealing with some opposition this month. Um, because I feel like somebody's going to be picking a fight because you got this Knight of Swords reverse. Somebody's going to be picking a fight. This is somebody that is insincere. They may explode on you or so they maybe they've done it before and they're going to do it again. They may be jealous. You could have somebody here that is jealous. Maybe you've already had some sort of victory. You've had some sort of victory and this person is taking justice into their own hands. They're jealous. They're upset. They're, they're angry. They're angry with you. Um, there is a reality check that is coming. You are unaware, okay, with that moon reverse. There is something that is about to be revealed that you are completely unaware of that has been hidden below the surface. It is about to pop up. It is going to change your life, okay, because it's, the moon is, is uh, right next to the death card, okay? So this is life changing. Your life is about to change. You are going to be going down a new path. You're going to be leaving something behind that has caused you a lot of pain. It's caused you a lot of suffering. Um, this could even be a family situation with the Ten of Pentacles reversed. I mean, this could be like a family feud or a living situation where there's been a lot of fighting. There's been a lot of... Uh, uh, disharmony there has there's been a lot of power struggles i do feel like there's you're dealing with somebody that is very cold that is very cold hearted this person um is always hiding something very very secretive whatever those secrets are whether it's you or them secrets are being revealed this month hey man some of you are dealing with the pisces we have pisces a few times um, or cancer. Um, hangman is letting go, sacrificing consequences, punishment. Somebody may even be getting some punishment with the hangman reversed. This is refusing, refusing to change. The hangman reversed is somebody that refuses to change, highly egotistical, refuses to budge, trying to prove a point, even though it's a lie. There's somebody here that's trying to prove something that is a lie. They refuse to give in. They refuse to give up. They're not learning the lesson. Um, not very enlightened. There could be some punishment that is coming. Um, Ten of Wands reversed. Ten of Wands reversed is a uh, collapse, right? It is. This is uh, making a conscious change, dropping something, uh, freeing yourself. I feel like you've been overwhelmed. I feel like you've been trying really, really hard to make something work. This is it. This is a breaking point. This is a breaking point. There's something that is coming out that is going to break you free from some somebody's 
uh, restrictions or somebody's uh, there's there's restrictions that are being lifted. Um, Knight of Wands, act now, think later, or somebody that's about to take action. This is somebody who has no fear. They're about to do something. Okay, this is somebody, may, this person may be frustrated, they may be angry, they may be upset, or they may just be full of passion. They're do, making a bold move, doing something brave. This is somebody who hates restrictions that is taking action. This is somebody that has no fear. They're going to be doing something. They're going to be putting some sort of plans in action. They have no fear, okay? This is somebody that rises to a challenge that is going to be doing something spontaneous. So it's a younger man. There's a younger man here that's going to be that's going to be affecting your life. This is somebody that um, is very daring, very very bold. That is, uh, I feel like this person. I feel like they've. I don't know if this person has been in the military or what, but I feel like this person is. Uh, he hates restrictions. This person hates restrictions. Doing something spontaneous. No fear. Definitely no fear. All over the place. Ready. Ready. Ready, 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 ready. Hope you're ready. I hope you're ready. Be prepared. Get prepared. There's going to be an arrival. This person comes flying in. They've, they've, they've got some sort of idea or information. This information changes your circumstances. It may even change your living circumstances or your work circumstances. This is somebody that is determined. They are very, very determined to take action. They're determined to... Uh, break free something about freedom here we have Hamian reverse ten of wands reverse eight of swords it's about freedom it's about freedom so something about freedom somebody wants to be free they want to be free from this restriction somehow you're involved so re there's going to be a change of some sort of restriction broken free breaking free breaking free breaking free from something you're breaking free from something good luck